Hey guys, I'm at Murray Bridge Caravan Park today and I thought I'd talk to you about a little issue that I've been having with my fridges. So I run a, a couple of fridges when I um, travel. These are my two wannabe Wacos. Uh, um, I used to put one on fridge, one on freeze, something like that. But um, I just had problems popping fuses all the time and I couldn't work it out. So I've been actually chasing this little electrical ground down for a year now and I finally worked it out and it turns out it was the plug that I was using um, I was using the one that came with the fridge it was like a wannabe Anderson plug cigarette rat lighter plug at the same time so I went and bought another cigarette lighter plug from a you know a 12 volt shop and uh, I was having the same issue again and um, I've realized that these plugs kind of wear out they must just get so hot that they um, wear out so I, ended up cutting them off and replacing them and uh, I replaced it with a Anderson plug um, and problem solved instantly but to get a bit more scientific as you know I like to do um, I'll get an infrared thermometer on the two plugs and uh, compare them and I'll show you the melted ones as well so here's the two fridges that have been running they've both got the same Danfoss compressor so they're very comparable um, to do the side by side um, this is the back of my car. I know it's messy. I haven't cleaned all the mud out of it yet But I've replaced all of these electrical components. So this is the bit just uh, a bit of a reference where we are um, This is my camera control unit um, brake controller Circuit breaker and I've got a bit of a fuse box at the back there um, So I've got both of these fridges running off of this fuse box and you can see, see this little nifty gadget if I hold this on here uh, the Anderson plug is getting to 30 degrees at the moment. It's about 28 outside to give you an idea. Uh, 30, 32, something like that. The cigarette lighter one. I've got a mark pointing this. 36, so big temperature difference. The only thing that's different is the plug. Um, just better contacts with the Anderson plug. Just in case you're thinking, oh, but you didn't actually measure the contacts, I'll do that as well. 35-ish. Hard to get it exact, but 35. Um, there's the Anderson plug. 25. So yeah, Anderson plug is way cooler, and not just because it's cool. So it'll be interesting to see if the current drawer is different too so uh, let's have a look at that so I'm going to be running the same fridge so um, this first of all is running through the Anderson plug 4.2 amps I'll just pause this and switch it over to the other one and through the magic of video camera now I've swapped the cables across to the same fridge and I was just using a little bit more power but what is more of interest is the plugs that I recently changed so this was one of them. This one, I was when it was a hot day, a 40 degree day, I was getting 40, uh, no, sorry, 60 degrees at the plug, measuring it. Um, and the same with this one here too. And this one, whether you can see it or not, actually started melting. This is the Merit Anderson, uh, sorry, Merit and cigarette lighter and the same thing. Bad plugs. If you've got one of these, cut it off, do yourself a favor and put an Anderson plug or, or something like this. And this is what I'm running the second fridge on most of the time now because the factory one was rubbish. I only had two earth pins. This one's got four. Um, and this runs even cooler again. So this is what I'm going to use going forwards uh, and also the Anderson plug. Hopefully this makes your fridges a little cooler.